Hi all, I hope you've had a blessed day today. Tonight we continue our countdown the top 100 Christian films of all time, and we have number 78, Androcles and the Lion. It was released in 1952, and it starred Gene Simmons as Lavinia, and you might remember her from another Christian epic, called Spartacus with Kurt Douglas. It also stars Victor Mature as the captain. And he was a Roman captain of the guard. Now, Victor Mature, really, they, this was right in between of a five-year run where he did Christian movies every year. Uh, some of them that I can remember were Samson and Delilah, uh, Demetrius and the Gladiators, The Robe, and, and this one. Um, there might have been one or two others as well, but he was most, his most famous film was obviously Samson and Delilah, where he played Samson. It also stars Alan Young as Androcles, and Alan Young, you'll remember him from the TV show Mr. Ed, about the talking horse. And of course, Elsa Lanchester is his wife, Meg. And you'll famously remember her as the Bride of Frankenstein. Now, Androcles and the Lion. Hmm. Uh, okay, Androcles and his wife are Christian slaves, and they're on the run from Roman persecutors. And um, they, well, Androcles finds himself in, the, in a forest, and he comes upon a lion who has a, uh, a thorn in his paw. And he removes it. And, of course, the lion uh, starts licking him. And, and he's very grateful. And so <clears throat> they become really good friends. And But because he's too busy playing around with the lion, the Romans catch up to him. And they bring him, they bring him back to Rome. And he's to join the rest of the Christian, Christian prisoners that they have to be eaten by lions in the Colosseum. There is a subplot here where um, uh, the captain and Lavinia are, they fall in love. And, uh, you know, Lavinia is a Christian and the captain is not. So it's um, a little conversion going on there. In the event, uh, in any event, the, um, as God would have it, while... Androcles is in the middle of the, the ring praying uh, to God for, for help. The lion that comes out to eat him happens to be the lion that he pulled the thorn out of. And the lion remembered him in his kindness and decides instead to spare him his life. Uh, what can I say about this film? <laughs> Not my cup of tea. I like Victor Mature. I even liked Alan Young on the TV show. But this was um, a confusing little bit of of a film as it wanted to be a comedy. It wanted to be a lesson in Christianity and how to turn the other cheek and live the life of Jesus. But um, I don't know. It, it, it didn't blend very well together the same way that Oh God did. Um, it just, again, you know, if you, if, if you can find the film somewhere and watch it for yourself, be my guest. Uh, but my, my opinion again, and my recommendation is that you, uh, kind of just, you know, watch whatever clips are on YouTube and enjoy those. But, uh, I didn't really care for this film all that much. Um, you know, so I, I think Victor Mature and Gene Simmons were wasted talents in this film. Uh, their, their parts in the film um, uh, felt forced and anyone could have played those parts. Uh, but thankfully they had really rich careers and they went on to bigger and better things. So anyway, that's number 78, Androcles and the Lion, 1952. Thank you for joining me tonight and um, thank you for supporting my channel and watching my videos. And tomorrow we'll be back with number 77. God bless you all.